South Africa President Nelson Mandela remains in critical condition with a lung infection. And today I sat down and did an interview with Ambassador Andrew Young, who knows Mandela, about the role he's played in South Africa and the world. I went to the Ambassador Andrew Young says he first met Nelson Mandela after he was released from jail. Most people don't know, but we had a very parallel history that just about the time that he went to jail, we were uh, involved in... Birmingham and Selma and things like that. As I sat down with Young today, he said one of the mistakes people make is they think Nelson Mandela is the singular saint that saved South Africa. He really was part of a, a total movement. In 1994, President Bill Clinton and Mandela appointed Young as the chairman of the Southern Africa Enterprise Development Fund, where Young says the focus was on ending apartheid with free enterprise and democracy. Young says the biggest thing people will always think about with Nelson Mandela is forgiveness and reconciliation. Here's a man who was in jail for 27 years, and when he was elected president, he insisted that his jailers be seated with his family. Young says one thing Nelson Mandela symbolized was that Africa had a leadership role in the world. The world is a much better place because of the life and the spirit of Nelson Mandela. And that spirit continues in South Africa. I hope I can live almost that long and, uh, and do almost that good. <laughs> And Young says Mandela is a fun-loving man with a very good sense of humor.